Hi everyone and welcome to my 7th episode. Today we're learning about Insert Love Motion. So... What is Newton's third law of motion? For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. For that, this ball bounces, I let go, and then it bounces, it goes downwards from, of gravity. Mm-hmm. But from the rubber inside, mm-hmm. it bounces upwards, causing an opposite force, but in the same force, right? In the same, yep. Like, as we, so, we, uh, as we walk, our, our feet pushes us, pushes us backwards, but we're actually going forward. Wow! <laughs> and it can also work backwards, which is very hard for me to do. And tell me if I'm new to the TV. Mm-hmm. So this time, my feet are pushing backwards and I'm going backwards. Mm-hmm. That's, that's very hard for me to do. And also, rolling a boat. Let's pretend that I'm in a boat. Mm-hmm. I push backwards, but the, but the boat goes forward. I'm pretending that the ball is the ball. Sorry. <laughs> and also, as we swing, as we swing, we, the swing goes backwards and then forwards. Is that a force? Yeah. Yes. It's because the, the swing pushes backwards. And forward, which is an opposite. That, that sounds the same as the ball. Well, yep. ball. Mm-hmm. So it's an equal and opposite opposite reaction. And maybe walking is the same as a scooter, a car, right? Then a swimming. Oh yeah. Okay, I'm not trying to. I was about to go off and pretend that I was swimming like that. But I just realized I'm not allowed to go on the floor. (laughs) Okay. For swimming, we push the water backwards, and the water pushes us forward, so we can go forward. <laughs> <laughs> All the way to the viewers, sorry. <laughs> cool. So that's... So that's New Tainter's Law of Motion! <laughs> yep. So, say bye now. Bye, everyone, and subscribe and have a like.